great sinners and yet great glory. And he goes, I can enter in with them. I probably didn't get all that right, but you get the point. <laughs> it was really Manessa, not Rahab. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I knew he would know that. <laughs> I, I just always hate it when I talk to him. <laughs> I'll, I'll bring up something and, you know, paraphrase it. And he'll go, he'll quote it completely and then give me, that's in Flavel chapter 1, page 692, right on the right, I think, second column. And me, I'm just happy I could read the book. <laughs> You're making all that up. <laughs> oh. That's why. It's, actually, it's a wonderful story yes. because... <laughs> Presbyterians are just Reformed Baptists who can read. <laughs> well, Reformed Baptists believe in everything. Presbyterians believe in it. Just forget the water. <laughs> no, we didn't. We just need more of it. <laughs> He's never read John 13. Peter says, if you, if you wash my feet, you wash me completely. Don't need the whole water. <laughs> and then the one, look, there's a lot of water here. We <laughs> Hey, Graham, I this over, or are we, are we passing? <laughs> <laughs> hey, now you guys know what it's like when it's just us and you're not around. <laughs> <laughs> okay, tell this story right. <laughs> oh, you, you, you're totally right, but then the, the wonderful part was at the end.